This is a KGUN 9 On Your Side news update. Well, so far this year, the Tucson Fire Department has responded to more than 70,000 medical calls. Some of those people were just in car crashes. Not on your signs, Veronica Acosta joins us in studio with more on what first responders do to make sure everyone is okay. Good morning, Veronica. Whitney, good morning. As soon as a team of firefighters are dispatched to the scene of a car crash, they're tasked with making sure that everybody who's involved is treated. Now, they start off by making sure that whoever is there is awake and well. If that is the case, then firefighters will move on to more extensive treatment. Firefighters who also happen to be registered EMTs, they'll determine whether the injured need to be taken to a hospital or not. Now, if the individual involved in the crash is conscious, then it's usually up to them as to whether they want to be taken to a hospital in an ambulance. Whitney? Thank you, Veronica. Well, a hostage situation at a Buckeye prison between an inmate and prison librarian is now over. The Arizona Department of Corrections says Timothy Monk took the employee hostage with a makeshift blade yesterday and demanded to leave the facility. Authorities were able to get the situation under control and no one was hurt. Monk was serving 97 years for sexual assault and other convictions. He's expected to face new charges. Tucson police are investigating a shooting across from Park Place Mall that happened last night. Police say a man drove up into a parking lot shared by several businesses, got out, and shot another man in the leg. He drove off. The shooting victim was taken to the hospital, but he's expected to live. TPD is still questioning witnesses. If you have any information, call 911 or 88 Crime. Ivan is in for April this morning. Ivan, what's the weather like today? <laughs> well, today it's going to be pretty chilly. Going into this weekend, even a little colder. We're going to see freezing temperatures heading into our direction and across southern Arizona. Several freeze warnings for different areas, hard freeze watches, and a freeze watch here for the Tucson area beginning Friday night and also Saturday into your Sunday. Your seven-day forecast is going to show 60% chance of rain tonight with a high of 59 degrees. Cool down a little bit more for your Friday, 53 degrees. Same for Saturday for the Arizona Bowl. Dry conditions are expected by then. To start off the new year, we're going to see a high of 55 degrees. Thank you, Ivan. For more news and weather updates throughout the day, you can go to our website, kgun9.com, and follow us on social media.